see if it's daily out the toilet out here so it doesn't have to take a long walk. Just <coughs> take it easy. Goodness. You're going <laughs> to the fence today. <laughs> have a new surgery. He's about to head off soon. Poor papa. Bay. Poor old boy. Kind of picture good day to be indoors, though. Well, you're indoors anyway. Good boy. It's going to be 38 here today, apparently. A walk? Yeah, everyone thinks they're going now. Rosie thinks she's going. Poor oh, Fuzzy. Gonna have his. Half his pants shaved off. Again. Yep. <laughs> Took him so long yeah, to grow Can you keep these dogs back? Yeah. Oh, big boy. Good morning. It is Thursday. Um, as you saw, Baddy's headed off to the vets because she's taken him. Which is good because I'm still up to win a bra. Um, so, just put on some comfy cool clothes because you can probably hear we've got both the fans so both the pen and I feeling the heat this morning we've got the fans blasting in there I'm so to clean but I don't know how it's going to go I have to try and do it early um, before it gets too hot but we'll just see how it goes because I won't get too sweaty because I will saturate that the um, thing on the back I was just going to show you a delivery I got yesterday it's, um, I actually saw someone got it on YouTube they probably had like you know a sponsorship or something i don't but and i haven't used it yet so i'm just going to show you to start with which is this lovely pretty box the pretty so it's just a shampoo and conditioner and there's a custom design it for you based on sort of what your goals are and you can pick your fragrance so yeah so i've got a straight medium i don't know i've got dry hair but that's what i picked apparently <laughs> and then my goals were um to soothe the scalp anti-frizz lengthen not that I really want to grow any longer, but I will need to lengthen the short bits that have fallen out <laughs> and nourish the roots and shine. And I picked the Feeling Fine Apple <laughs> fragrance. So it tells you there sort of what sort of the hair goals are and how long how often you should use everything. You can get these coloured, I just got the plain. I kind of wish I got it coloured, but I didn't. And I've got some cute stickers in that. So that has sort of some kind of membership thing. I haven't looked into that yet. So you get the bottom of a bottle of your um, shampoo, and you probably can't see it because it's white on white. It's just function of Libby and the conditioner, and they smell divine. Kevin and I smelt them yesterday. And then you get two pumps. I'm hoping if you get refills, you don't get more pumps. I don't even know if I'm going to need the refills because I'll probably put it in my container inside. And I got the pack that had the little travel things i've got these but i thought they were really cute and these are the good um the gucci ones these are the look like the official proper ones that i've got not um yeah so they are very nice so they'll be good i can put some in i don't know how this is going to go i'm going to push you the shampoo it's going to be a trial to see if it's any good for my psoriasis if not i'll just pass it on to the kids and i'll keep the conditioner but um Kind of expensive. Yeah, it's pretty expensive, but I guess I pay, pay a lot for um, for um, shampoo anyway. So but I think that might be even more expensive than my normal shampoo. I was expecting a bigger bottle, but anyway, that is fine. I will try it out, and obviously, if I reorder, you'll know that it was good. But it smells amazing, um, and I'm just hoping that it um, works well for me. But I'll let you know. But I thought it was very cute. I wanted to show you anyway. It's a nice gift for someone, actually. Like if you kind of knew what their hair type was. Like maybe a family member or something where you knew. It would be a nice little thing personalised. <laughs> and you could you can get different colours. And I had a teal. I probably should have got the teal. But I'm thinking I won't get any colours added to it. So I didn't. I mean, it's pretty anyway. I started to do a bit of cleaning. I've dusted downstairs. I'm not going to do the... I was going to do the kitchen. But I've got to wash up first in... Then I might do a bit of it and then finish a bit later on. I've got a bit of a headache. So that's all I've got to do today, I think. And just the bathroom. Chrissy's going to do the rest of the cleaning for me. So, 
Obviously, I don't feel great though, but I'll get the washing up done, at least then that can dry. <laughs> and then I can decide whether I'm going to continue on with the kitchen now or later on. I feel this is going to be another very boring vlog. I feel like I just film the same things over and over again. So please let me know if you ever get sick of it and you still like other stuff. <laughs> Obviously, if you get too sick of it, you don't have to watch anymore. But uh, if I just, if you find it just getting a bit repetitive, I try not to film the same things all the time. But it's my life at the minute. Oh, my head is so sore. But hopefully, once my back recovers more, we'll be getting into some more decluttering. And I know most people like that. So, well, most of my viewers like that. And um, we're off to Canberra this weekend, so I'll have something more interesting for the weekend. <laughs> For those of you who like travel stuff, some people don't. It's that's hard. Everyone likes different, different things. It kind of works out, I guess. When you film, you know, everyday stuff some days. You know. Anyway. Sorry, I'm moving on. Let's just watch it. I'm going to film this for you. That's what I'm setting up the tripod. <laughs> so I have something to... Um, I don't know. Maybe if you haven't got done your washing up, it might inspire you to go do your washing up. <laughs> from the vets and Bailey's surgery's all over it went well so hopefully he should be home on Saturday and then I just realized we're going down to Canberra on Saturday so both Christy and Kevin and myself have all offered to stay home but I think if we can get him in the morning early and bring him home to Nana Pops which is where he was going to be for the weekend I'd be okay going away but I feel like we've got to go pick him up and I just want to see he's okay before I could go away. I wouldn't want them having to go pick him up. So, yeah, so hopefully <laughs> they'll be okay. If not, obviously someone will need to stay home, I think. Probably me, really. But, um, yeah, hopefully it works out that we can pick him up and then head down. Um, yeah. Because we are just going for one night and coming back the next day. <laughs> Okay, kitchen is pretty much done. I've done all I'm doing anyway. I'm gonna leave the basket there because Chris has got to do something. I did realize I haven't done the bathroom yet. Put the cloth through there and I will um do that. I just had my head move and I'm I'll leave that outside to remind me to do it later on and I'm gonna go work on the puzzle for a little bit. So I've been working on another puzzle and I'm going to have to have some lunch now. And yes, I'm a bit addicted to <laughs> puzzles at the moment. I am just going to do them until Prothy goes back to TAFE. So another month maybe I'll work on them a bit. And then I'll um, put them away until next school holidays. It's sort of going to be my rule, I think. <laughs> Not that it really matters, but you know, I've got the other things I want to do as well. But I really do enjoy doing them. But I think I kind of need a time frame of working on them. Thanks, Bailey. You're helping clean too. Bailey? Yeah, he's licking the... He was licking the Bailey. Oh my gosh, code, I guess. <laughs> you didn't even realise. No, I didn't. I thought you were just saying that you, it was you cleaning because you're doing your cleaning now. Bailey, was a little bear. He's not here, mummy. It was a little bear. Rosie just has snoozed pretty much the whole day. That's clean. So just once again, working on my photo book. Um, trying to get rid of a few pages because it is so full like it's 200 pages which is the maximum so I just got rid of another two to send 
I'm just going through and seeing if I can condense. Like I had this one spread over two pages and I had this one, I had that as a whole page one. So that looks fine. I like my photos to be a reasonable size for most of it, but I'm just trying to see what I can do, if I can do anything. So just going through, see what I end up with. Got really windy outside now. As you can see, Rosie hasn't got much of a choice. She has to be the playmate today. Since Bailey's going to be in hospital to Saturday. I should be getting up to make dinner, but I'm just trying my photo book finished. And I have a headache, so I think this is going to be something really quick and easy. his ugly face. <laughs> I don't think this little puppy wants me to finish doing my photo book. I think he wants me to do his dinner. He said time of day starts crawling on me. Licking my toes and trying to tell me it's time to do dinner. But he's a bit early. Science is about five o'clock now. <laughs> and I'm just trying to get this photo book done. I'm nearly nearly done. Well, I've still got one more final check, but um, I've got to the last couple of pages. So, that's dinner. Got in scallopini, rice and corn. Why did you stop it? So you can talk to your people. And I'm ready to film the show now. Mm -hmm. Didn't need to stop it. Have my thoughts here. Have you returned to Fraser's Ratchet? I'm watching Outlander. I am Major John William Gray. 